Hello everyone, Bonzergib1 here. So, if you remember from my uh, pollination video that I did, I think about a month or two ago, I pollinated a yellowish looking uh, Phalaenopsis flower. Well, this is just an update to show you what's happening, and it's quite amazing. So, this is one of the flowers. And as you can tell, it is blown up to like 60 times its original size. I mean, look how massive this is. That is unbelievable. The flowers start, started wilting, which is a good sign, and this is just huge. And if you remember, I said I might pollinate something else. This was the, the actual flower that I pollinated uh, in the video. That is cr It's almost the size of of a small cigar or a cigarette. It's... I can't believe this. So, that means the pollination was successful and will most likely give me tons of little seeds in a, in a couple months. So, well, after this, we need to wait until it starts drying up a little bit. A lot of scientists like to get them when they're green, so then you can go ahead and plant them straight into a flask instead of actually going through bleaching and sterilizing. So, um, during this process, you want to make sure that you labeled your orchid while pollinating because you want to make sure it's about the appropriate time time interval so that the scientists know how, how um, old it is and then you can send it into a lab and they'll tell you if, if it, you're ready to cut it off and set it in to go get it propagated or germinated. And I'm, I'm stunned. I'm stunned that this happened because what happened was I had a little bit of pollen in here. I had two, two little pollen glands in there from the, the pollen parent. And I put it in there and it wasn't working. So what I did was I separated, I took half of that, half of the pollen and put it in there. <clears throat> and both of them closed up immediately. And I got two seed pods. Very excited. I will keep you all updated. I will post um, down below the the video again uh, as a link so then you can go check that out on how I pollinated the Phalaenopsis so then you can get good results on that and that is it thank you very much for watching again as always and don't forget to subscribe down below because I have many more videos coming so many updates and so many plants in bloom it's it's unbelievable so that's it this is Bob Zirka 1 thank you very much for watching and happy growing